Steve. Uh, Antonio Kenyatta, uh, I, I'm a you know, financial advisor, but I work with uh, target those in the medical profession. Yep. Um, so uh, for me, Gary, obviously, good evening, maybe for you, so good morning. But uh, my question is so, uh, in the process of moving forward with everything I've learned from losing great, you know, um, I'm getting lots of interest, um, but I've come into a new challenge. Yep. And it's a good challenge, but it's a, you know, it's a challenge in that. Um, so for helping, you know, all these medical professionals with their debt, um, the, the lenders normally receive their payments via check and that, that whole process. And so um, it's not, uh, there isn't, you know, some of what some other, like a mortgage is, there are a lot of banks you can tap into and, and deal with that electronically, but for them, it's still kind of a paper process. And so I have the, uh, the the challenge I have is I want to reach out to them and say, look, um, you know, we have this growing um, body of members in the medical profession who have, you know, X amount of money in debt and would be interested in, in um, you know, shifting that burden, that problem over to us to pay those bills uh, to you electronically. Um, and so you know, these guys, uh, these companies are giants. And so my, my question to you is, um, what, you know, because I'd have to reach out to them via email, um, I'm sure I wasn't getting one on the phone, what approach, um, and, and the problem they would have, I guess, the, from my view, their problem would be, you know, their costs, the cost to, you know, process checks and the security and the inefficiencies all behind that. We would, by bringing them payments electronically, they, you know, just, there's so many more benefits. I don't want to talk about benefits. I want to talk about their problems and how we can add values. So I just wanted to get your ideas on an approach in an email, um, you know, even if I got a conversation, but most likely it would be email to um, to reach out to these these giant lenders. Well, I think in this case, there needs to be a business case for them, a solid business reason why they should make the change or add uh, electronic transfer as an additional option. Now, yes. are you saying that you have a group of people that would be new income for them? That They're they existing debt holders to them who oh, okay. are normally will be paying by check. I see. I'm saying the efficient, you know, there will be new ones, but they're already going to, they already owe the debt to the lender. Okay. It's the payment process rather than them writing checks every month. Um, we could do that for them electronically. to make so that I, process so more I efficient. think in that case, what you want to do is, wouldn't it be to their advantage? Isn't it obviously an advantage to them to do that? It's just probably an old yes. process they have in place. Yes. So I don't think you have to sell them on why they should do it, is my guess. Because okay. I think that's prob probably obvious to them. They're just kind of living in the dinosaur age and haven't moved forward yet. But what I would do if I were you is send an email saying, I represent these medical students or doctors, total of 2,000 or whatever the number is, that are you know, working with you on, on their pay repayments. And um, as a group, we are wanting to see if you'd be open, if you'd be open to considering adding uh, electronic transfer payments to the process so that uh, my, my group of people uh, can be more efficient with you and not take any chances of making mistakes with checks. And then you add the problem at the end of that. Does that make sense? So it's more yes. like, are you open to adding this new process in to avoid these problems that represent my folks? Mm -hmm. and let's just see. Maybe they're working on it. Maybe I think the I think that's the first start in your process to see if they're even okay. open. Yes, and just go to the top people with that. Oh yes. Okay. Okay. Exactly. Okay. That's exactly that's exactly what I was looking for. That you know just needed to figure out a good angle and you know always get. That should open the door. That should open the door without them feeling like you're trying to like push something through, right. which would be open. The right. classic stuff. Excellent. <laughs> <laughs> Good to see you guys, Tony. Thank you, Ari.